Good morning, folks. It's your favorite lesbian here. Uh, this lesbian's on life is singular. I'm the only one in the house right now. But I have a, you guys might know, I have a love for funky t-shirts. So I'm gonna put some pictures on the end of this, kind of showing you some favorites. One, actually two are from New York. And one is, um, says pink as fuck from Pietro Nolita, little eater, eatery in um, Manhattan that I really like. Don't know if it's still open because I don't live there, but I went pre-pandemic and blah, blah. Pre-pandemic is awesome. The other one also from New York says, and you're gonna have to forgive the punctuation and grammar in this shirt because it clearly not made by a scholar. I got it uh, on the uh, Pride 50th anniversary that I wasn't planning on attending. I was having a rough day. I was sobbing like a lunatic in um, my Airbnb. And I went outside because I heard some noise. And my gays doing what they do best saw me and told me to, you know, pucker up and and uh, go be part of Pride. Painted my face, gave me a shirt, and it was a fantastic day. So that one says, eat pussy, it's organic. It's totally appropriate. And they, I don't even think they had any idea. I'm kinda already doing that. Um, so I'll get pictures of those. I have a birthday shirt that the wife got me also and uh talks about how long i've been awesome gives away my age but recently i was out with a friend and she bought me the shirt i'm wearing and this is the shirt i love it it's everything i stand for but i don't know what it means i need help so if you guys can tell me what this is i would appreciate it so here's what i need to know so maybe a little backwards but it's got like cute little lambs or something and it says, nobody likes a douche canoe. I don't know what that is. If you guys could help me, that would be awesome. What is a douche canoe? It's a good chance I've probably acted like one a lot. Anyhow, Brooklyn, out.